This is the CBS 3 Next Weather Storm Alert Day. Here is Chief Meteorologist Kate Bilo. Well, we do have a next weather alert for tomorrow. We are getting you prepared ahead of time. Rain and storms throughout the day tomorrow. It starts out with rain by late morning through the mid afternoon hours. Then the storm chance really fires up late afternoon into the evening. Any of these storms could produce heavy downpours, especially north and west. As far as severe weather is concerned, the greatest risk will be severe straight line wind gusts in excess of 50 or 60 miles per hour. For tonight, it is still quiet, though you can see the clouds are starting to build in after a sunny start to the day. It is now just a bit cloudier, but this front is all the way back here. Now we do have waves of rain coming in out ahead of it. This is a very convoluted system. One strong cold front and it's pulling in a few other storms with it. So we will have to watch the timing of the rain and whether we could see the uh, severe weather is going to depend basically just on how unstable the atmosphere is able to get. One thing that could stabilize the atmosphere and thus diminish the threat for severe weather will be the rain that comes through late morning into early afternoon. This is right around the lunch hour. Scattered showers, a period of steady rain that will keep it cloudy and cool. That will limit the amount of available energy basically for storms to form in the afternoon. But if we do see severe weather, it will likely be late afternoon, especially north and west. Biggest threat, severe wind gusts. And then into the evening and overnight hours, that's when our greatest threat for heavy downpours emerges. So it's a marginal risk, a level one out of five risk, a low end risk, isolated severe weather. But again, any of these storms could produce damaging winds. Several downpours cannot rule out an isolated tornado, especially in the southernmost part of this highlighted area. Coming up, I will time out the storm threat hour by hour tomorrow and tell you what to expect once this cold front clears the area tomorrow night. For now, we'll send it back to Yuki.